alien bodies and they went to Port and Down, which is on Salisbury. Most deadly viruses on the planet. If any of those viruses got out, we'd all be dead in about two weeks, they say. Bro. Yeah, so we just got out. Yo, they're There's after us, man. Somewhere. They are after us. We are currently being held by the police and unmarked unit. Police dogs. Um, yeah. Something's going on, guys. Guys, finally had breakfast. Uh, we had Subway because they didn't do a full English breakfast, which I'm a bit disappointed about. Yeah. I was I was looking forward to that. So I'm joined today by Matthew. He has a channel, the uh, Secret S Vault. Secret the Secret Vault. Vault. You know what? I've even seen these videos before I've even met him. Me and me and Carl spent hours watching these videos. Like, like this guy's a veteran. Like, how old are your videos on YouTube? Tw yeah. 20 years, <laughs> 20 years. Um, yeah, they, they, some of them are going on like 15, 20 years old, these videos, yeah. That's crazy. So this, this guy's going to be showing us around, you know. Get over, head over to his channel, subscribe. He's done loads of underground stuff. A lot of you guys love my underground stuff. So if you want more content, go and check his channel out. What's your problem? Nothing, mate. We have a lot of stuff nicked from around here, so I'm just... Uh... On your YouTube? No, I'll sure. your channel because you'll appear on it, so I'll show you. No, I don't. I don't. I'm not interested. That's so mate. why are you taking pictures of me in the car? Because we've had stuff nicked. Well, you can see I'm not a thief. I'll show you. I don't know that. I don't know I'll that. Show you. I'll show you. I'm not really interested. Well, I'll show you. I'm not a thief. No, what? I'm, I'm holding the phone. I'm not accusing. Camera. I'm not, I'm not accusing you, are, you of You're taking pictures of me. No, I'm not. No. So I'm videoing you. You've just gone onto our land. I'm just turning around because we're documenting all the underground what spaces. You, what sort of spaces? All the underground of Wiltshire. Right. I'm okay. from the, I'm from Lancashire. Lancashire. I've travelled down to document all the underground spaces. I do underground okay. underground oh. work. If you go on my YouTube channel, you can see yeah. I've just recently done the viral YouTube uh, videos of underground yeah, yeah. Manchester. Right. So I'm not a thief, I just document I didn't, history. I didn't say you are, mate. And and I hope you have good fun. I hope, I'm not quite sure what it is you're doing, but I hope you get what you want. Well, we just we explore underground tunnels. That's yeah, all good. it is. All right. I'm on YouTube. That's what yeah, I do yeah. for a living. Yeah. All right, well, good, good luck. Guys, yeah, this is what we have to deal with on a daily basis. People like this, they just want to get involved for no reason. Don't quite know what was going on there, but something weird about that guy. Yeah. We haven't even done anything. We could not have gone on any base. This is a public road leading to a village, so they know straight away. And I think it's got something to do with the fact that we actually were too honest. And they're using that as an excuse now to kind of, you know, be itching the people. But, uh, you know, we're just a car driving up a road. I mean, you know, and the guy's like, why are you here? Don't push the sharing later on in the vlog. This is going to be cool. Bye. Right, this is uh, Sands Quarry and it adjoins the underground city called Burlington. Yeah. And if you go in here and down a slope shaft, then you come to a set of tunnels and a big door and you can't get any further. But some people have got through that door. I did get through there once and uh, there's footage online of what was inside. Quite an interesting day out. Uh, cool. And that's on, your, that's on your channel? Yeah, absolutely. We'll check his channel out, guys. Let's do this. Um, and basically release the videos in weeks to come. Ah, it's crazy. So here we go, check this out guys. People have got Wait a minute. Well, it could be somewhere around the side, you never know. Oh yeah, there is a hole in the side. Oh my god, yeah, so here we go, see? Somebody's been uh, looking out for you guys. <laughs> yeah, this is the way in. <laughs> Steve found the way in. We have evidence it wasn't us that did it as well. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here? No. How would you get through that one? Nearly fell. <laughs> they put some uh, anti anti explorer grease on the ground. <laughs> Jesus, they really have done a good job on that since I've last been here. It used to be uh, just a sort of bars, but now that's. That's iron girders. That's proper iron girders they got down there. Yeah. Right, so right now, Matt has brought us to uh, to one of the most important buildings in uh, the MOD. So I'm gonna let him fill you in on the information. Three cameras, my God. <laughs> <laughs> this is interesting. Yeah, this is the Command of the Defence Communications Network. The British MOD, every bit of telecommunications goes through this place, encrypted and not. And they have the uplinks to the uh, satellites, which are known as Skynet. And uh, that keeps the military and communications all over the world. So this 
is as important as some citadels in London, GCHQ. It all happens here, but it just looks like a leafy lane. And they've even built a couple of uh, kids' swings outside it just to make it look like it's all nicey-nicey. But yeah, there's a lot more going on beneath the surface than meets the eye. So a lot of people think it's a rumour that uh, Rudlow Manor used to deal with UFOs, but it's actual documented fact that the MOD have admitted that the Provost and Security Service used to get every single report from worldwide if it was to do with the military, and they would come through Rudlow Manor, they would investigate them, sometimes even send out plainclothes officers, which became known as to many in the ufology community as the men in black, uh, to interview witnesses, and in some cases would even ask them not to talk about what they'd seen. So that's one of the origins of where those types of stories come from. That was all investigated at the Manor House in Rudlow Manor in Caution, Wiltshire. Excellent things that they were investigating. And uh, you can still get access to some of those. So if we go and have a look at where they were doing the investigations and where the, st the storage stuff was, and I think all the, the investigations we, we were doing prompted them to move the base away from here because it was just too much attention. So they moved it to uh, uh, in a place near Hertfordshire. Now, what were they investigating again? UFOs. It was like a UFO signing or crash, right? Anything that was an unidentified flying object. I mean, when you think about it, the military have to uh, have to look into things in case they're military incursions by Russia or right. some From foreign country. power. Yeah. So they're always interested in stuff, you know, testing out radars and, and whatnot. And uh, yeah. yeah, they had a thing called the Flying Complaints Flight, which used to deal with a lot of this stuff but I mean basically we knew it as the UFO reporting centre but uh, the technical name was Flying Complaints Flight. Uh, you know, Guys so we just got in the grounds of the official, now this is, doc you can go and check this online, Rudlow Manor UFO investigation site. You see they investigate UFOs here now, rumour has it a UFO crashed not far from here and what they did is they dragged the UFO here then they sent it into the Burlington Bunker and when it was in the Burlington Bunker they stripped parts off it and some parts, where, where did some parts of the UFO go to? But there are rumours that uh, some of the bits were sent to a place called Fort Halstead which deals with military weapons testing, they've got scientific people, they can uh, disassemble rockets, uh, grenades, reverse engineer. Explosive. Yeah, reverse engineer, find out what makes things tick and find out what's in them, we need to go over this way and the registry is just over here. Um, yeah, so they're the specialists and also uh, there's rumours about uh, alien bodies and they went to Port and Down, which is on Salisbury. And that place deals with the most deadly viruses on the planet, so if any of those viruses got out, we'd all be dead in about two weeks, they say. So uh, that's where they took that to a sensitive, probably frozen underground facility. So yeah guys, that's some crazy, crazy stuff has happened. I mean, I'm not saying that aliens exist, I'm not saying they don't, you can't prove it. I'm not saying aliens were here, I'm not saying UFOs were here. What I'm saying is, a lot of stories went on about here. And apparently there's a lot of documentation as well, so I'm going to see if we can find some documentation stating UFO sightings. about alien bodies that may have come through places like this, Port and Down. Um, we don't know for certain, but uh, what we do know for certain is they investigated stuff here. All the UFO reports would come through this place first, and the MOD have confirmed this. They're quite happy to say that, and they would have come here, guys would have investigated them. In some cases, sent out officers to interview witnesses and silence them, ask them not to talk about what, they, what they'd seen. And these were plain clothes guys, so you can kind of see where the stories of men in black may have come from, bases like this. All the buildings. Let's see what we can find. Bro. Right. Let's get down here. Move down here, yo. Security. It was security. 
Dogs. Okay, dogs. Yeah, no. Yeah, me too. Alsatians, man. Dog Germany. What were the German Shepherds? One's a German Shepherd. Uh, you get that on camera. Oh god, oh god. Okay, he's like clip. Holy fuck. Shit. Dude, I would have like climbed this building. This is buildings here so I went in this one last time the door the windows are open, that but, open. yeah but this one I didn't go in so what's in that one uh, nothing it's just glass on the floor and shit yeah. oh, look, look, look. since the last time we've been here everything we've done has now been secured each one we didn't secure that one which is what we didn't manage to get into so thanks very much as soon as possible. Yeah. You getting a bit worried. Is this Steve. the manor house? No. Yeah, I'm getting I am getting a bit worried. Those dogs are too friendly though. I don't understand. Yeah, I thought that. Do they walk past? No, no, no. She's not as much as that. She's walking yeah. down here towards oh, us. Shit. Okay. Let's go. So, what's the matter, Hans? I don't know. This one of the UK's original Harry 51 locations. It's definitely a bit on top. I see them two dogs. I'm surprised they didn't charge it. It was maybe the orders only. Like they'll charge when they're ordered to. So this was where the rotor command and control center for the southern sector and they intercepted ufos there on the radar screens and they scrambled they scrambled jets to intercept them so you know that sort of stuff was going on here see ufos get a jet out there try and intercept it
I don't know what it is, but something's locking it. But some of these are open, they're locked now. Definitely locked out. Guys, we're leaving now. We are leaving now because uh, them dogs. She says to them dogs, get them. And then more me and Steve. Carl's gonna have a hard time getting home. He's gonna cry all the way back. So yeah, we're at Low Manor. The home. The home of UFO research. Yeah. Here we go, Steve at the, the home of the UFO research. Right, let's go. Yo, so we just got out. Yo, they're There's after us, man. They are after us. We are currently being tailed by the police and unmarked unit. Well, we think it's the police. Uh, they've been following us for about 15 minutes now. Uh, they did actually put the, the, the sirens on before, trying to overtake cars and get around the corner, and then uh, they seem to stash out behind a, a van. And yeah, they've been following us for absolute ages now. I don't know what to expect from these uh, these people from behind. So, what do you think of that, Dan? Um, men in black. Men in black. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Turn the camera on. Turn the camera on. Huh? Turn the camera on. It's on, it's on, it's on. Yeah, yeah. This car's pulled over now. Yeah, have you got the camera? We don't, we don't need to. I'll do it the doors. What? I'll do it the doors. They're already locked. Right, they're locked, yeah. Don't need to. Um, is it recording? What? Yeah. We're recording. <coughs> we don't need to. Um, we pass my camera from the back. Come. Where's the back? Just right behind you. Is that my camera? Yeah, yeah. Cheers. Back up. Well, so so yeah we're currently um currently um been followed by uh the police and shit so um we don't don't know why i'm entitled well everyone's entitled there's, there's another car i think is it um we're pretty much entitled not to op open the car door or anything like that police dogs um, yeah. Something's going on, guys. Yeah. Inside, inside, not to. Um... <laughs> you, have, you have to come. You have to come this side. The window doesn't open. Why? You have to come that side. Why? Yeah, because the window doesn't come down. Wind it up a bit more, man. Hi, what's up? Oh, have you got camera yet? Yeah. Just, just to let you know we're, that you, uh, we're YouTubers. recording just for our purposes. Okay, and, yeah, and fair enough, yeah. Okay. We're, we're all YouTubers, that's all. So again? We're YouTubers. Ah, oh, right, okay. So what, what are you doing out here, guys? Yeah, we're on a road trip. Yeah, we're on a road trip. Sorry, you'll have to speak up. We're on a 10 day road trip. Right, okay, doing? Exploring uh, abandoned places. Exploring what? Abandoned places. Abandoned places. So where have we been today then? Uh, we've been in Wiltshire, Kent. We came from Kent, been okay. in Wiltshire. Been in Corsham today? Yes, just come from Corsham. Is that from like the over at the, the computer centre? The yeah, the tunnels and stuff like that? Yeah, we've been near there, yeah. Okay. Bear with me. Okay. <clears throat> oh, yeah. So, yeah, um, don't know what's going on. Uh, Ari, I don't know, but. To show what something's that? going on. What about that? Yeah, exactly. There you go. So, is, it, is the conspiracy theories real or, or I don't not? know. It's, it's something weird going on, guys. <clears throat> I don't feel quite comfortable because she got out and kind of like let, let us know there's dogs there, like open the dogs just like really crazily. So, yeah. Hi. Hey, are you alright? Yeah. Uh, whose vehicle's there? Mine. Yours? Yeah. And who are you? Daniel Dixon. 
Sorry? Daniel Dixon. And Daniel, have you got any ID on you, please? Uh, I don't know. You haven't got any no. you have a wallet or a bank card? No. Or... Uh, no. Okay, and where are you from? I'm from Preston. So you've come all the way down here? We're doing, no, we're doing we're on a 10 day road trip. We're YouTubers. Right, okay. So you haven't got a wallet or a bank card or anything on you on a 10 day road trip? No, I've got a bank card. Right, okay, can I have a look at that? <coughs> Yeah, but why is that? You don't you, you don't need you even need to do that though. Pardon? He doesn't need to show his ID. I'd like to know who he is. Yeah. Just make sure this is his vehicle. Yeah. Right, okay. Yeah. At. That's absolutely fine. Lovely. Hold on a second, mate. I'm just okay. gonna get my back. Okay, thank you. I didn't know you're inside a lot. I know, but I just I don't want to yeah. you know entice. Mm. Wow. It's just really weird. I've not been in a situation before. It's really mm, strange. Very strange. So obviously maybe the places that we have checked out today, um, maybe it's definitely, definitely linked up with uh, the MOD still. Very strange, isn't it? Yeah. Very strange. So, but um, is it a Dixon, 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 Dixon with an X? The is, it, is it about Dixon the with a D? Yes. Lovely. Is it about the UFOs? House? Is it about the UFOs? Yeah, we've been doing a documentary on the UFOs. No idea, what, no. Right, okay. Nothing to do with that. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay, all right. So what's this about UFOs then? So we're YouTubers and we do, um, it's gonna sound weird, but we do abandoned places, conspiracy theories, and um, we've been doing uh, all the abandoned Woodlaw Manors and uh, the Caution Centre right. and the Burlington Bunker. We've been doing a big documentary on that. Okay. Um, so we've been round, been round all that area today, um, documenting it. Right. Um, seeing if there was any open entrances, there wasn't, unfortunately. Yeah, um, they tend to keep that kind of place. Yeah, down. yeah, and because we heard quite a lot of um, there'd been a UFO taken down into the Burlington Bunker. Right. And parts have been stripped off, sent to the CCC to uh, reverse engineer for projects for our country I'm guessing. Yeah we do a lot of um, documentaries on those, like we did one on Loch Ness Monster up in Scotland. <laughs> yeah we've yeah. done a lot of Ness Monster, that was uh, December last year. You want to take my YouTube channel down so you can check it out. Yeah, it's, uh, can you can subscribe, <laughs> it's exploring with fighters and these guys have got their own YouTube channels. Anyway, let's um, we'll find out what happens. We should be able to talk pretty soon. Yeah, if you can get the real trip too. <laughs> well, this one right here. Yeah, this, yeah, we're on a, like, a road trip. Okay. It's come all the way from America for this. Yeah. <laughs> YouTube, yeah. 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 We do. We do. Sorry. Steve's got 400,000 followers. I'm only at 37,000 at the moment. I mean, who are you? Who are you? I want Steve's YouTube. <laughs> Steve Ronan. Right, okay. Let's read up. No. So, whose car is it, sorry? Mine. It's yours, sir. Yeah. I'm unfortunately, I have to tell you, your vehicle's been cloned. Wow. That's the reason why we've come up with your know, guns blazing and chasing, yeah? Because this car was yesterday, there was a vehicle you go, using your registration what? moving about in London yesterday. There you so, go, no. so I was we, in London. We were in London yesterday. No, we wasn't. Oh, no, oh, no, 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 Three days ago. Yeah, so. Um, Don't drop a minute when you ain't done no, it. <laughs> no, we was, we, yeah, we was in London three days ago. So we did, yeah, you got handed to us yesterday, done some work on it, and you were in Chippenham yesterday or in the Wiltshire area. Yes, we were. Um, yeah. And the, um, the same registration was being used in London at the same time. Wow. So, so okay. someone's copied your, your plan. Basically. Wow, no way. So right. they, they are they're bad naughty people. Um, so that's why we have I followed you up here. So it's definitely not to do with the UFO conspiracy. <laughs> <It's definitely> no. <laughs> <laughs> We've been doing a UFO documentary today down in Caution. Yeah. So then when all these police cars surround us, I was like, I knew it, I knew it, it's something to do with the UFOs. The FBI, they've come to look us up. No, 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 so your, so your number plates, somebody has has copied your number plates and put it on another vehicle, right. which they're going out and committing crime with. No way. So you no. may The well, same car? So on an exactly the same vehicle, but obviously the chassis numbers are different. Right, okay. So um, you may well get stopped by police okay. in the future. Um, what we can do is there we'll anything put a bit of black uh, tape on you you've got some black sort of tape i'll get out so you're not all looking down i don't mind have you got a sticker or um, <laughs> yeah it's the craziest thing ever i just don't know i just don't know <laughs> is there a conspiracy there matt now now you understand when i tell people they now 
Now you understand, right? When I tell people that if you go near Rudlow Manor, they will fuck with you. <laughs> and they just fucked with us. You've been right well, all this time. That's crazy. <laughs> oh my days. Dude. Dude. Oh, oh my god. When, I told she, you. when she didn't move, when she wouldn't get out of the car and I saw another one coming up behind a proper car with dogs in it, I thought, we're gonna get bit. Yo, <laughs> dude, I, I messaged uh, the group chat, the exploring crew, like Josh, Cody and John. They think I'm fucked right now. I was like, dude, FBI caught us. <laughs> we're screwed, they're taking my camera and laptop. <laughs> Man, that's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, the conspiracy is real. I, I'm thinking we don't do the exploring now. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking we just. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not feeling that exploring now. I'm shook. I'm shaking. You know, I'm like shit. Yeah. Your own. Yeah, but how 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 would they know the actual car is cloned? Exactly. Look at this way, right? I'm driving the car. Well, Carl's driving the car. Unless they had that other car impounded, how would they know this was? Clo you know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. If, it, if, it, if there's anyone clued up on the police, leave a comment right now. Let us know what your thoughts are on this, because because I'm miffed out of it. Well, I'm not miffed out. Well, I'll it's actually you, miffed. <laughs> it's, it's miffed me. I'll tell you what doesn't make sense. If the car was cloned yesterday in London, they said, yeah. yesterday, it could drive around London racking up tickets. They wouldn't know that that wasn't you until you didn't pay the tickets, which can't happen since yesterday. So how do they know the car's cloned? It's not cloned, it's bullshit. It's not cloned. So, why would they just drive away now? Because they know who you are. That's all they want to do is establish who you are. If they mm. could have done that in Corsham, they'd have been happy. But they didn't catch you in Corsham, so they've been tracking oh, we've you been, all the way. We have been floating around so, Corsham, yeah, like round, now round. they know who we are, they'll just leave us alone? Like, I don't get it. They don't want, they just want to make sure we're not terrorists. Um, yeah, I mean, you, you've got to bear in mind that that place is the new secret GCHQ that they're trying to play down. And we've been hanging around the CDCN. Yeah, yeah, we've been know, hanging around. Why the Defence think, Communications why Network. Why do you think <laughs> I planted in her mind straight away UFOs? Yes. Because then she's like, UFOs. As soon as, soon yeah. as you mention UFOs, they're like, oh, you're they're right. Just, they're just a bunch of crap pots. You know, <laughs> just a bunch of UFO yeah. idiots. That's all they are. They're not, they're not threat to us. Yeah, yeah. That's why I planted that. Mm. This now, ANPR, right, picks up your number plate. That bloke knew we were there at Monk's Park really fucking quickly, right? And he came out and he was like, whoa, 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 what are you doing here? Yeah, but he wasn't in the security thing. He didn't see us pass. We hadn't rumbled any security guards. So they knew when we drove into that village, like they do with my car, because my car's flagged, which is why I often jump in someone else's car to go mm -hmm. in there. They, you are actually a bit too fucking YouTube star for your, uh, your, your own good, I think, yes. Because I think they knew when you came to town, oh shit, something's happening, yeah? Because they got AMP, yeah? They got a lamp or something. They were like that, you know? And it could be, it started with the guy where we asked him nicely in Octavian Wine Merchants. It could be there, and he passed the number back, and they all started, oh, what's this number, what's this number? Let's check it, check it, check it. And they put you on AMPR so they could get you wherever you went and just check what you're doing. So it could have been that, but it could be because you're a big YouTube star. And they've been watching your channel. <laughs> YouTube star. Okay. Yeah, and you're getting famous, bro. And you could have a okay. new subscriber tonight. Yeah, I got so some. Whoever that subscriber is, might be them. Yeah. So, yeah. CCC. <laughs> they knew we was in caution today. Yes. Right, yeah. because he said you've been in caution today. And he said that we was in London yesterday. So he was like, it's been cloned. So, wait a minute. It still doesn't... Yeah, can't they find sense. out where the other car is right now then? To compare like... Don't know. She didn't really not say anything, did she? No. About what happened to the car, so... We should ask I, that question. I personally think it's because we've been lingering around the main government centre. Yeah. I really do think We've so. probably passed the AMPR so many times and probably like, right, this car's passed the AMPR ten times today. Mm, yeah. What's Check going on? Why has why it passed our AMPR so many times? Mm. Mm. Yeah. I don't think we should be messing about with aliens. No, let's, let's just <laughs> leave it to this guy. Let's leave it to Matt. <laughs> a secret vault. <laughs> but but I might vault. go missing. I need you guys you to go, come out and find out where go, they took me. If you go missing, we'll come back and investigate. Yeah. Oh, thanks, guys. <laughs> <laughs> we don't hear from you again. Right, let's get a hotel, guys. Yeah, let's get a hotel.